last ones here, except for Opal. Oh, oh these are beautiful. Oh, Oh, you're welcome. Hi. Has anybody heard from her? Uh, no, but uh, I'm sure she'll oh. be here. Oh, yes, she better. I can't have both my mother-in-laws missing yeah. my wedding That's shower. Right. What about Ruth? Oh, she had to work. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, what a shame. Yeah. Uh, Dixie, can I talk to you for a second? Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Excuse sure. me. I, I just wanted to hey. tell you how much it means to me to be invited here today to be considered among your friends. Well, I think you've changed a lot. And everybody deserves a second chance. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, there she is, girls. Carmen Miranda. Oh, it's a pretty, pretty woman. All right, all right. I'm going to step out of you, girl. Thank you for coming. Oh, are you kidding? I'd like to meet the fellow who could keep me from it. Um, oh, Brooke, I hope you don't mind, but I have a friend visiting from out of town, and um, since she's already been invited to the wedding, not that it was okay to bring her today. Sure, sure, welcome. Everybody, I want you to meet. This is Alice Dawson. She is Adrian's mother. Oh. I'm Adrian's other mother. Oh. <laughs> well, you you have a lovely son. <laughs> Thank you. Here, you know, we're so glad you came. Oh, yes. Let's everybody sit All right. down. Yeah. Oh, okay. Let's have a little champagne or a mimosa. Okay. Are you okay? Yes. Not very good company today. Oh, what happened? <clears throat> I found out I'm not pregnant. Oh. Well. The best thing I can think of saying is think of the fun you'll have trying again. Yeah. Oh, you're disappointed. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm gonna be fine. I'm not gonna be a party pooper. You're not a All party pooper. All right, everybody. Pooper. Everybody get a glass. Everybody have a mimosa or some champagne. Yeah, I think we're all set. It's time for a toast to Tad and Dixie. Some things are meant to be. Oh. Here, 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 here. Janet. Oh. It's actually my gift's a little more practical, you see. It's from the year of the leopard. Year of the leopard. I can do it. <laughs> The next celebration is to welcome Erica back to her old friends. Well, in another 36 hours, Vanessa Bennett will be history. Yeah, well, when that woman's gone, she will know who her friends really are. <laughs> All right, everybody, it's time for the entertainment. We're going to play a game. Oh, come on, you're going to love it. Yes, you'll love it, you'll love it, you'll love it. You'll love it. We're writing a little story for Tad and Dixie, and you all have to help me finish it. Oh. I know this game. Oh, do you? All right. All right. Listen, we're going to go around the room and ask everyone for the name of a food. Any Gizzards! Food? Gizzards! <laughs> Not yet. Okay. And I think we'll start with you. No. Yes, oh, you. Okay. Yes. All right. Belinda, give me the name of a food. Any food. Uh, uh, butternut squash. Oh, <laughs> what did she say? Butternut squash. <laughs> Phoebe, at all. Any uh, food? Pasta fagioli. Oh, okay. Oh, there we have it. This is it. All right? 
I smell Pulitzer here. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> All right. What we have here is the um, story of Tad and Dixie's honeymoon night. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. <laughs> All right, let's start. Tad swooped Dixie off her feet and carried her across the threshold, saying that she was as light as butternut squash. No. <laughs> See, that's why I had to carefully consider mine. It doesn't fit at all. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> Tad laid Dixie down on the bed, saying, her hair smells like anchovies. Her skin was like mashed potatoes. Her breasts were like... Oh, chocolate-covered peanuts. Well, that can't be accurate. <laughs> uh, Dixie told Tad he was as handsome as liver pate, as smart as cottage cheese. She said, make love to me with your cookies. Tad wrapped Dixie in his Brussels sprouts and ravished her with his pasta fajou. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> and the important thing is they lived happily ever Oh. Yes. Thank you so much, everybody, for your, all the presents and your kind words and for just showing up. <laughs> okay, one more time, everybody. All right. Uh, Ted oh. and Dixie, he's a lucky man. Oh, and she's a lucky yeah, woman. And she's a lucky woman. Mm -hmm. Because mm -hmm. they found Very each lucky. other. Right. Oh, luck doesn't even begin to describe it. When I first came to town, I knew nothing. <laughs> And then I met Tad and, and just fell in love with him. And, and then when I lost him, uh, well, it just goes to show you that life is full of miracles. <laughs> love itself is just such a miracle. And I have it all around me. Tad and my friends and my family. And I just feel so very, very lucky. Thank you all. Oh, <laughs> oh we've done a long, hard show. This is the keeper, right? So, Dixie, what about Tad's bachelor party? What about it? Well, is he having one? Well, yeah, I mean, I'm sure they're doing something for him. Uh huh. Strippers? Exotic dancers? No, I hope not. Tad would hate that. Sure he would. He would. Trust me, he would. That's too bad. Sounds like Tad's gonna miss out. Unless... Oh, no. no. How much courage do we have? Courage to do what? No. <laughs>